you know, the West was best. It's better than the way things are now, when you think about it. You had your horse. You take your tent and your horse. You go wherever you want to go. Not many people owned land at all. You've been on your horse going across the map for days and days. You want to stop and sleep, rest and eat whatever you had to hunt down so you wouldn't starve to death. You could put your tent wherever you want and mostly nobody had a say in the way you put your tent down. You know, that's America. Put your tent wherever you wanted, set up camp wherever you wanted. Feed your horse like it's no problem. And one coin, that's the best thing about it all. One coin to take care of everything. You know, when you roll into town and they go right for the bar, you know what? And I don't blame them not one bit. Being out in the sun like that and beer is all you had and the water was bad. That's why they got hooked on beer. It's all they had. It's not their fault. But the point is, after being out in the desert and all that, ice cold beer, doesn't that sound great? And not just because that's all you have, but it just really sounds good. So yeah, I mean, you gotta think about it that way, you know? And so you put the one coin down. It pays for beer, it pays for dinner, it pays for a room. It pays for new boots and oats for your horse, you know? And it pays to have someone so you don't feel so lonely. One coin paid for everything. Wouldn't it be nice if life was that simple again? Now imagine this. And if, and if we are in a simulation, then it would be nice when you can't afford things for your fridge to restock itself. Say you're out of your favorite beverage. You close the door, you open it, and there it is once again. Let's really get into manifestation, and let's really manifest things. You want things, you gotta manifest it with all your heart. But in the Old West, whatever you found was yours, you can claim it. You know, sometimes you don't even have to bring it to whoever to approve it. You found the chest, you found the chest. Jewels, diamonds, rubies, whatever, mostly just gold. It is yours. But the point of this whole video was how the West was best. And then it wasn't no and people got used to shootouts. It was no big deal. The better man always won. Until someone come along and showed them how to use the fists, the first ever bar fight. <laughs> you know, and I don't even know why I have memories of places I've never been. Maybe I have been there, and I just don't know it. Maybe I have been in the West in, the, in another life. I sure do know a lot about it, for some reason. I know a lot about a lot of places and a, where I've never been. You know, when I didn't even exist yet, I have memories of that. I have memories of the war. I've seen so much when I sleep. But the point is today of the Old West and how it was best. And I do have one more grandfather still with us, physically still with us, who got me into watching westerns. And I just want to say to you, Grandpa, I still want to get on horseback and go across the map with you. You know, sit around the fire with you. I wish I could do that with you, Grandpa. Because, you know, for us both, for everybody, time is short, limited, and borrowed. And I wish I was around the fire with you, sir. I wish I was going across the country horseback with you, seeing it all. You know, doing everything with you, sir. Because cause I, I love you, sir. 
But yes, the old west, where all you needed was one coin to take care of everything. I really need that in my life right now. Maybe I'll start collecting. I don't know. And it's really ridiculous nowadays. You gotta... Usually the... the Usually the saying goes, you got to spend money to make money. But now, to turn money in, it, it costs to turn money into other money. Isn't that ridiculous? You got to pay to pay, you know? Or you got to pay to receive money. You got to, like, what kind of ridiculous world are you living in? Where all you youngins have to pay for money. The Old West, one coin taking care of it all. You all should break away from this nonsense because supposedly heat, because you know what's going around and why we got to keep our distance. Heat kills that, okay? Go somewhere hot, but bring water. Get your tents, you know, and people of the RVs, people with horses. Just get away from the madness. I'm telling you, while we all can. You know what? And as the man said, go west.